Well, the cleanup is underway in Barrie, where a tornado tore through homes and flipped over cars. Residents returned to their homes today to salvage what they could while crews worked to restore infrastructure. Matt Ingram has the latest from Barrie. It was banging and crashing and wind and then we came up. That's what we found. Moved to tears by the harrowing experience, Jeff Owen and his 15 year old daughter sheltered in the basement while their street was torn apart. I just broke down. It was quite scary. Jeff's wife, Brianne, and their 12 year old son arrived home just after the tornado hit. Environment Canada says it packed winds up to 210 kilometers per hour and left a trail of damage five kilometers long and about 100 meters wide. Their home wasn't too badly damaged, but others weren't so lucky. As I looked out this door here and uh, the roof was gone. Parts of Jack Beaver's roof were blown completely off while he, his wife, son-in-law and grandson were inside. Luckily, his family wasn't hurt. Other homes also lost roofs and at least one was completely flattened. No one was inside at the time. It was only a matter of seconds that come and gone. Here near the center of the devastation, the scene is post-apocalyptic with debris strewn everywhere and cars thrown around like they're toys. Neighbors say this blue pickup truck flew four houses down, flipping and crashing into this black truck. The city of Barrie says 10 people were treated for injuries in hospital with about 150 homes damaged and 63 uninhabitable. Not only was nobody killed, but nobody was even missing. Just astonishing. Barry Mayor Jeff Lehman says only two people remain in hospital, neither with life-threatening injuries, and the cleanup is already underway. The city is cleaning up uh, the roads and working on the basic infrastructure, so water and the electric crews are working on electricity house by house. Crews are collecting debris from the roads while roofers patch holes and contractors assess the damage and board up windows. Some people returned this morning to sort through the rubble while others collected whatever personal items they could. Premier Doug Ford visited the neighborhood to witness the devastation himself, calling it a miracle no one was killed. We're going to have their backs, we're going to have their support, anything they need will be here. Barry was hit with an even more powerful tornado in 1985 that left eight people dead. Matt Ingram, CHCH News, Barrie.